All right, what's up guys? We are on the beautiful Atlantic Ocean. Left work at around 11. Uh, just couldn't resist coming out here and try to catch some fish. Uh, we are gonna try deep. Last time we were out, we started shallow, messed with a bunch of sea robins. Then we went out to 50, about 50, 60 feet of water. Started picking up fluke. There were no keepers, only that one keeper sea bass. But, uh, so we're gonna go straight out to deeper water. Our buddy Dan is out here. Uh, he just started a YouTube channel called uh, Fishing Accomplished. Go check his stuff out. He's a uh, very good fisherman, also fishes out of a Hobie Outback. So he's got a keeper right now. He's where I was planning on going, just going straight out to 50, 60 feet of water. And uh, so we got a little bit of a pedal ahead of us. We gotta go pretty far, it's a gradual drop. So we got a little bit of a pedal. So he's got a keeper fluke. We're gonna go check it out. Nobody on the board has a keeper fluke yet, so he'll be the first, unless I knock his ass off the, off the board. Joking, obviously. Um, so when we get a little closer, We'll uh, tune in again. All right, so Dan's way out there. He said the, the bite has died off, so he said he's gonna come in shore a little bit. All right, so today we're gonna be fishing a half ounce funky bucktail, all pink, pink head, pink hair. Then we're gonna put a one of these 7 eighths ounce squids on top. And we're gonna put a little dabble of Procure squid gel on there. This stuff's pretty good. You only gotta reapply it like once every maybe I do it every other like every like six drifts if you catch like four or five fish just put a little dab back inside of them Ooh, we got marks on the bottom so I'm gonna tighten our drag because we loosened it up a little bit let me get down there What do we have here? He's not fighting. Hope it's not a skate. Where's Sea Robin? Last time I got into deeper water. Oh, it's a foul hooked fluke, that's why. Foul hooks always fight a little harder than normal. Sorry, little buddy. Next time, take it in the mouth. Huh, I forgot to put a gulp on. I was too busy BSing. Man, it's funny. Let's get back down there. I don't know where Dan is. There he is. What's up? What's up? What's going on? Oh! Nice. Whoa! What's up, man? You were out there, huh? Dude, I was way. <laughs> I was like, I'm in 50 feet of water and I don't see you, man. Yeah, I, um, <laughs> this might be. And every time I was about to come in, it was just uh Fish, keep this shit going. Yeah. 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 It was a little breezy this morning. And I was like, I was looking at the. Uh, I don't know, man. This side might be a little close. I'm gonna put him in the net just in case. Yeah. So I got to work and I saw this wind picking up. No, he's not a keeper. Close though. We had a little wind actually. Be nice. Right now, I think the Eighteen. Like dead low, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Every so often I pick up something, but the wind is nice. You can't be moving it just the right way. Yeah. I'm drifting at about half a knot. Yeah. I think it's going to, like you said, pick up and um, it's supposed to switch to southwest, I think. But uh, this is a small, small fish. <laughs> Let's see that keeper. Ooh, nice fish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's an eater. 
Oh, no. There you go. Little guy. Tiny little thing. Huh. I think mine's even smaller than yours. Uh, work. I got a job with the highway department. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I was trying to apply with Town of Huntington, but uh, it's just so political. Yeah. And uh, I put in an application here and I got the job. Nah. Are they fishing in Huntington? Huh? Are fishing in Huntington? Nah, I, I never fish up there. slack tide now oh doing a little artificial drift and as soon as I started moving seems like I had something pick me up right here oh there we go is he on there no hope he didn't bite me off sometimes all you got to do is just do a little artificial drift he's back I got him that time. Artificial drift. Sitting there, you straight, your vertical. Just put it in reverse and do a little artificial drift. Dog shark. Come here. Yeah, that's right. No spines, right? Nope. Yeah, back, you bastard. Got a knife? All right, I think we're gonna make a move to deeper water. Tide should be picking up here in a minute. I've been fishing slack tide for almost an hour now. So hopefully when we get a little deeper, we have a little more tide. It's a bit, uh... Oh yeah, it's not bad. Well, something's gonna have a good snack down there. <laughs> Let me cut these babies up. If it, if it wasn't slack tied, I wouldn't mess around with this, but. All right, so we got that dog shark all cut up or dogfish, whatever you prefer to call it. Got a nice little strip here. 
put it on, it's real tough to get on, so you just gotta watch your fingers. So poke it through. Actually, that went through pretty easy. Look at that. That'll last forever. We got a whole bunch. They're all day. All right, deeper water. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Dog shark. Big dog shark. The whole time up, we're going to pray that it's not a dog shark, but it is. It's helicoptering. No, huge skate. Don't get caught up in my drive. This is where the pliers come in handy. Sinar. Oh, he got me though in the finger. Fifty-one. You ever hit already? I think the story of the season out here right now is fighting through the shorts. Yeah. That was a sea robin. <laughs> oh, that was a nice bite. Oh. Premature hook set. They look a little guy. Definitely a little, little guy. It's a fluke though. Yep. Alright, so we just left Dan. Dan is uh, going to head in soon, and I'm going to fish another hour or so. i um, going to go back out here to deeper water, about uh, 45 to 50 feet of water, where I was catching some fluke earlier. Had a couple nice like 18 inch fish mixed in, so maybe there is a keeper in there. So I'm going to head back out. We got tide moving, we got incoming tide, which has always been the hot tide, the flood. So uh, we're going to give it a shot again.
There's like a sea robin. Actually, I don't know. A couple head shakes like a fluke. Oh. Oh. He spit. It's fine. He wasn't the keeper. All right, guys. Well, I think we're gonna call it a wrap. Um, the southwest wind's starting to pick up a little bit. Getting a little bounty out here. Nothing terrible, but uh, it's supposed to be about 15 miles an hour in about probably about an hour or so. So I'm gonna head in. Uh, it's a good day. We caught a bunch of short fluke, a uh, ton of sea robin. Oh my god! But uh, Dan, we met Dan out here from Fishing Accomplished. He's a hell of a fisherman. Uh, he got a fluke just before I got out here. He's a keeper fluke. Uh, he got a sea bass too and a bunch of porgies. So he's eating good. I gotta beach this thing and then figure out what the hell I'm gonna eat for dinner. I might just go to Salivars and get some fluke farm. My favorite. So we got a little bit of ways to go. We gotta beach this thing, load it up, and get out of here. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, hit that subscribe button. Smash the like button too, and uh, leave a comment. I love hearing uh, everybody's suggestions or questions or anything. So, thanks for watching.